Today's video features Liner, a brand that distinguishes themselves from competition with the premise of being a luxury brand with Scandinavian designed products, all at a cost of 50% that of traditional retail prices. Within their brand, they have a sterling silver and solid gold line starting at $15. So now moving on to the individual pieces from this brand. So the first piece I have is a pair of earrings. These are called the Kirsten Pearl Huggies. They are made of a gold verme. These retail for $72 on sale from $84. They have removable freshwater pearls. The hoops have a diameter of 10 millimeters and the pearls have a diameter of five millimeters. So overall, I feel these earrings are a very subtle look. They're quite lightweight on the ears and I like that the hoop is an entire circle making it really comfortable and I don't have to worry about it falling off. Next up, we have some rings. They are both made of the gold verme, which once again is in 14 karat gold. Gold verme is a high quality type of gold plated jewelry. Standard practice calls for the gold plating of jewelry to be at least 10 karat gold and at a minimum 2.5 microns thick. Liner's gold pieces are made with 14 karat gold versus the 10 karat gold and they are 2.5 to 3 microns thick. The first ring we have is the Lily Ring, which is on sale for $38.25. This ring features a round solitaire stone, which is five millimeters in diameter and also available in four colors. The stone I selected was white topaz. Next up, we have the Live Stacker Ring, which is once again coated in that gold verme. It retails on their site for $18 and it's available in sizes five through nine. I got my ring in a size seven just because I don't always wanna wear this ring on my ring finger. This is a dainty ring that looks great on its own or stacked with other rings. For a few highlights on this brand, they began selling online in 2014. They are currently based in Hong Kong with no physical store locations. They sell directly to customers, cutting out extra costs and markups, passing those cost savings on to you. So in theory, you are paying one third to a quarter of the cost of traditional pieces. They work with artisans in Europe who also work with leading luxury brands. They have an emphasis on sustainability, selecting eco-friendly and long-lasting materials. Their jewelry comes in three different options of materials, sterling silver, gold verme, and 14 karat solid gold. Their sterling silver pieces are 92.5 pure silver and 7.5% other materials. All of their sterling silver pieces are also coated with rhodium, which adds to the shine and luster of the pieces. Gold verme is a high quality type of gold plated jewelry. Standard practice calls for the gold plating of jewelry to be at least 10 karat gold and at a minimum 2.5 microns thick. Liner's gold pieces are made with 14 karat gold versus the 10 karat gold, and they are 2.5 to 3 microns thick. So therefore, it is thicker than most gold plated jewelry and around 100 times thicker than flash plated jewelry pieces. Lastly, they offer solid gold pieces made of a 14 karat gold, which is 53.88% gold. For a few other key points about this brand, Liner offers free international shipping for orders over $75. Liner also offers 30 day returns, which of course excludes final sale items. If you're interested in checking out this brand, I do have a special offer down in the description box below. So feel free to check that out if you're interested in this brand. Overall, I love the subtle style of this brand. It's not too loud or in your face. I do like the fact that the gold for May is thicker than other brands, meaning that these pieces will hopefully last longer and not tarnish and fade the same way as others. So anyways, that should do it for today's video. I hope you enjoyed it. Let me know in the comments down below what do you think about this brand? Do you like the style? Do you like the fact that it's also a sustainable brand? Be sure to subscribe if you like content like this and I'll see you in my next video. Thanks for watching.